Hello everyone, it's me Dori and welcome to my channel. In today's video I will show you how to create this DIY moon face chimes. And if you've been following me for a while, you probably already know that I do share certain obsession when it comes to moon face. In the past I already made a video on how to create this picture here on the wall representing parts of the moon cycle so I will list that down below in the description box in case you guys want to check it out. For this project you will need a package of these very thin slices of shells. I found mine from the dollar store. You're also gonna need white acrylic paint and black one. A variety of uh, brushes drafting compass and a pencil or a sharpie, whatever you have. A glue gun and yarn or cord, just a string from where you can hang your chimes. So let's get started. I selected a total of eight shells. So I'm covering the main moon phases. I'm also using this little moon calendar as a reference so I don't mess it up. And then with the help of my drafting compass, I'm tracing perfect circles on the shells. One thing you need to keep in mind is don't press it too hard on the shell because it will break. Those are very fragile. And then this is very optional and I will do it just so you can see what exactly is going on. But I will trace all of them with my Sharpie. Here I will do the actual faces and you can do it with the drafting compass or just improvising it. You don't need to be too precise, I guess. <laughs> It's supposed to be a fun project, so you know, don't stress out too much. What follows now is to paint the moons. And I'm starting with the white paint because it's much more easy to fix it if something goes wrong. So here is my full moon. Here is what will be my waning or waxing moon. And my first or last quarter. Then I am adding the black paint, starting with the new moon or the black moon. Then followed by the waning or the waxing moon. And my first or last quarter. <laughs> you can either leave them like this, black and white, or you can add some of these uh, moon craters and shadows. So what I do, I just add like a little bit of black and then I'm trying to smudge it so it blends better and it doesn't look like a round Dalmatian dog. <laughs> it's not like the best representation of the full moon, but I mean, it will work, it will work. And 
and I just will do the same with all the other moons. Once they're done, you just need to leave them to dry for a little while. Once this is done, then you can just glue them to this string or cord or whatever you have. I'm making a knot for one of the ends so I can have my chimes hanging from there. So this is relatively easy. You just use your glue gun and put a little bit on the top, a little bit to the bottom of the shell. And, and you're doing the same for all the rest. It's very easy. Easy peasy. When this is done, this is optional, but you can just finish everything with this uh, varnish spray, finishing spray. Just be careful and do that outside because it smells a lot. And here it is, the final product. It's very easy DIY, it doesn't take that much time and I believe that it looks kind of cute. So I hope you guys liked it and if you did, please don't forget to subscribe so you can get more of my DIY videos. I'll see you guys next time and until then, be happy, enjoy life and stay inspired. Bye bye!